I've wanted to enter the My Road Reel competition ever since it started, but the story has always been a stumbling block. Choosing an out of copyright hymn ticked a number of boxes. It's a tried and tested story, something with substance that's worth the effort to put into it. You have a backing track. For the music, I downloaded the MIDI file of the SATB for Dear Lord and Father of Mankind and dropped it into Reaper. Then followed a process where the sound and the images fed each other and built up into something more, more full. We started with an arrangement in E-flat with just one voice and then with the help of my family it evolved into a into a more, more rich SATB four-part choir piece in E, which was a rewrite. But the timing wasn't tight, so we added in some instrumental layers, adding more voice tracks until it had quite a rich texture. And that in turn impacted the dancing. The vocals were all recorded on Rode NT3s through a phonic helix desk into Reaper. The orchestration was mostly using Plog's Tsotsando plugin for virtual playing orchestras, really nice samples. There's a rich collection of high quality sound fonts out there, free and they cover almost any instrument you can think of. The video was all shot on a Sony A7S, mostly with a 24-240 zoom but also a 90mm Tamron and a lovely wide 19mm Vivitar for most of that last verse. The A7S made lighting much easier since we could literally shoot by the light of a single candle. Editing, grading and effects were all in the free version of Lightworks, although I used Resolve to create a more editable Cineform intermediate from the MP4s. In terms of process, dance, the Kira Edwards did the choreography and the dancing and was amazingly patient with retakes and trying different ideas, waiting whilst I set stuff up. And the ideas and the orchestration filled out. She reworked the dance to fit it all together to make a more complete item. It was all shot at the school where I work. It gave me access to a lot of lighting, venues, but made organizing venues sometimes a challenge being shared with others. That challenge of lack of availability of venues was actually what triggered the overlays. The seashore shots from a colleague. Hopefully this can take an old song and make it a bit more accessible to a, to a new audience. That would be cool.